Jumping on the Moon short stories for kids. Today we have a book named Jumping on the Moon by Anya Walia short stories for kids. I think they're so pretty. I hope you guys really enjoy it. I love it. Please give this video a like if you enjoy it, and don't forget to subscribe for more stories. Thank you, reading. So, here we go. Meet Spacey Dust, Spacey, and Alexa. Spacey Dust is pronounced Spacey Dust. Spacey Dust is orange, and that is his favorite color, too. He has one eye. Spacey Dust has a slimy body. Spacey Dust lives on Saturn. Spacey Dust's superpower is controlling the wind. Spacey Ice is pronounced Spacey Ice. Spacey Ice is white, and that is her favorite color, too. Spacius lives on Neptune. Spacey Ice has one eye. Spacies has a slimy body. Spacies' superpower is shooting ice out of her hands. Spacies has a nickname that is icy. Alexa is the size of a rocket, but still big. Alexa is narrow at the beginning. Alexa is shaped like a popsicle. Alexa is a color between the color of Antarctica and the color of regular ice. Alexa is made out of ice. Alexa is a rocket. Spacey Dust had just sent a note to Icy. The note said, Come to Saturn right now and bring Alexa with you. Icy read it. Icy said, I have to go now because Spacey Dust says to come now. She went to Alexa and hopped on her and commanded her to go to Saturn. Alexa blasted off to Saturn. The ride was only for 15 seconds. When Alexa landed, Spacey Dust said, I want to tell you something. What? said Icy. We are going to the moon, said Spacey Dust. Okay. How do we get there? asked Icy. We'll go on Alexa, of course, said Spacey Dust. Okay. Let's go, Icy said. They hopped on Alexa and commanded her to go to the moon. Whoa! Whoosh! Alexa went so fast nothing could see it, past the two planets. When they were flying past Earth, Spacey Dust turned Alexa towards the moon. When they landed on the moon, Spacey Dust jumped on the moon super high. I see do a jump super high, shouted Spacey Dust. Okay, shouted I see. She jumped super high. When Spacey Dust and Icy landed on the ground, the two aliens saw a rocket. Let's go, said Spacey Dust. Okay, said Icy. The two aliens slid towards the rocket, and the aliens went through the door of the rocket. They explored the rocket from top to bottom. The inside of the rocket was gray. The aliens found the control room. Wow, there are so many buttons, said Icy. Let's click one, said Spacey Dust. Okay, said Icy. Spacey Dust clicked a small orange button. Icy clicked a small white button. Both Spacey Dust and Icy clicked a big green button. The rocket flew off like crazy. What? Both of the aliens screamed. We need to shut the rocket off, said Icy. So Icy froze the rocket, which also froze all the rocket's door. The rocket fell down to the ground. Spacey Dust and Icy tried to jump to the door, but it wouldn't bud. Spacey Dust used hot air to unfreeze the door. So did Spacey Dust with the other doors. When the aliens got out of the rocket, Spacey Dust used hot air to unfreeze the rocket. Spacey Dust said, let's go back home. 
So the two aliens went to their planets. The End Good job, friends. Thank you so much for reading with me. Bye, I'll see you next time.